A very special good morning ladies and gentlemen. Welcome once again to Big Stone Television. As you know the series continues. The series of those great musicians, singers and players of instruments. Those who are still here with us today and those who have just gone too soon. Today we're going to present to you again one of our great 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 musician. His name is Lloyd Brevet. Lloyd Brevet was born on the 1st of August in 1931. He was a Jamaican double bassist, songwriter and a founding member of the Scatterlites. He was a Rastafarian and the uncle of the Melodians member Tony Brevet. Brevet, born in Kingston, Jamaica, was a founding member in 1964 of the Scaban the Scatterlites. He toured many countries with the Scatterlites and produced two Scatterlites albums, African Roots in 1975 and the legendary Scatterlites in 1976. He once stated, Ska was our type of music that could lift the youth and make Jamaica known around the world. Brevet was awarded the Order of Distinction by the Jamaican government in 1981 and the Silver Musgrave Medal in October 2010. He toured and recorded with the Scatterlites from the beginning of their reunion until 2004. Brevet toured briefly with his own band and then retired to Jamaica in 2005. On the 3rd of May 2012, Brevet died at Andrews Memorial Hospital in St. Andrew, Jamaica at the age of 80. Brevet had suffered a stroke in March, two weeks after the fatal shooting of his son, Akeen, one of ten children that he had. He was buried at Maypen Cemetery. Now this is what the newspaper had to say about the legendary Scatterlight. This newspaper article paid tribute to one of the greatest musicians that ever came out of Jamaica. This article came from the Gleaner and it was reported on the 4th of June 2012. It says the wither Ruth Brevet found it difficult to hold it together and broke down on numerous occasions. The great man was gone. Brevet was a founding member of one of Jamaica's most important musician groups, the Scatterlites. At the ceremony, opposition spokesperson on youth and culture, Olivia Bobsy Grange, described Brevet as a pioneer. He and his group paved the way for reggae music in a way that has transcended all barriers creed and races, Grain said. She also expressed sadness that Brevet's son, Akeem Brevet, was killed after accepting an award on behalf of his father just a month before his father's death. She offered the family her condolences and warned the public to cherish icons while they were alive. Grange also expressed disappointment that the church was not filled with persons from the music industry and the media. Those scatter roses after we are gone, she said. Grange also said she wanted to see an expansion of the Jamaican Museum as well as the creation of a memorial park to keep the legacy of icons alive. Every time we lose an icon, we lose a part of us. As an industry of which I am a part, I want to say, get our house in order, she said. Lisa Anna, Minister of Youth and Culture at the time, also shared the view that a facility needed to be created to document and display the great contributors to cultural development. She said, Brevet Death was a big loss to the music industry. He really has contributed to the fabric and the foundation of certainly one of our best legacy, 
which is our music, is considered a pioneer basis and we don't have many persons like Mr. Brevet anymore. He was an icon and we hope that more people will get involved and learn the culture and history of our music. Get involved in understanding the foundation that has been laid for them. Many of their families are still suffering because of hardship which they went through because of the nature of the industry at the time. Many of them were taken advantage of and the young people must understand, appreciate and get involved with the work that was done by these men who gave great contribution to the world and our culture, Anna said. Veteran musician and member of the Jamaican Recording Industry Association, Michael Ibu Cooper, also shared his view on the work of the late Scatterlight. According to Cooper, Lyde Brevet was a mentor. I used to watch the Scatterlights in JBC and emulate them. They were like my teachers. I was not in a classroom with them and partially responsible for my direction into music. They created the bass drum and millions of dollars have been made based on their creativity, he said. The iconic Lloyd Brevet O.D. was laid to rest at the Maypen Cemetery. Lloyd Brevet, Order of Distinction. What an icon. At this time, I just want to say my condolences goes out to the Brevet family for producing such an iconic force that has given us sweet, sweet reggae music from the ska era up until reggae music. I share the sentiments with both Lisa Anna and of course the Honorable Babs the Grange. We need to have a park, a memorial park where our icons, all of them, are laid to rest. We also need to bridge the gap between the elders and the younger musician who can play the double bass like Lloyd Brevet in these times. I hardly can point a person, a young man, with the skills to play the double bass. What about the trombone? Who is present today that can play like Dan Drummond? Who is present today that can play like Roland and Fanso. The saxophone. Well, of course, we have my friend, Dean Fraser, who I consider one of the best saxophonists today. But we must build a university. We must build a university. And I think, and this is my suggestion, and if I add the money, the Ambassador Theatre which is in Arnett Garden or Trench Town should be the location for the University of Arts where we teach regular music, where we teach care music, where we teach mental music to our youngsters, where we teach them how to play an instrument. Today, ladies and gentlemen, my heart is weak because I understand the situation. Most of our youngsters have gone to picking up the gun when they could easily pick up an instrument and become great. Lloyd Brevet, you came, you saw, you definitely conquered and you have left a legacy that nobody can fill your shoes, sir. Nobody can fill the shoes of the legendary the iconic Lloyd Brevet. May your soul find eternal peace among our ancestors. Your music certainly, sir, will live on forever and ever. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. The legendary, the iconic, the pioneer, Lloyd Brevet. Gone definitely too soon. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and share this video. And if you have not yet, make your contribution to my channel. Now is the time to do so. Thank you so much for watching.